we see a lot of patients for breast implant revision, breast implant removal, and they're older implants, and they have no idea the FDA's recommendations for silicone breast implants regarding breast imaging and monitoring the rupture rate. Currently, the FDA recommends an MRI or ultrasound five to six years after placement of your silicone breast implants. And then after that, you're supposed to every two to three years get an MRI or ultrasound. Now, if there's a symptomatic issue with your breast and the ultrasound's normal, you should get an MRI because an MRI picks up way more ruptures than an ultrasound, and that's also recommended by the FDA. With an MRI, that rupture sometimes looks like what's called a Linguini sign, which is a unique finding. You should always stick to the recommended breast imaging and screening. Now, these are the FDA's recommendations regarding breast implants. Obviously, there are other recommendations regarding routine screening, and those are important to follow as well. In my practice, I like to get an MRI in a lot of patients because ultrasound just misses so many ruptures when they're inside the capsule and MRI picks up a lot of those ruptures. A lot of this breast imaging stuff is controversial. So if you have any questions and you wanna send us a DM or a message, I'm happy to try to answer or ask one of our radiology colleagues to help.